so hi everyone we will try to understand what is levinstein distance and how it is calculated what is its algorithm so basically levinstein distance is the minimum number of edits required to convert string 1 from uh, to string 2 by performing three operations one is addition removal and replacement for example if we have two strings cat and bat the levinstein distance equals to 1 because we need to perform a uh, replacement operation to re by re uh, by replacing c with b similarly if we have a string c at and bat i think you are following my screen so in that case the levinstein distance would be 2 because we would be first uh, replacing c by b and other and then we would be removing e hence uh, one remove operation one replacement operation this is how this is how levinstein distance is calculated between two strings and you must be you know and you must be surprised to know that the fuzzy fuzzy library that is uh, in that is very prominent in python for calculating the fuzzy ratio between two strings uses this levinstein distance logic only so let's understand the code first so levinstein distance is getting implemented using the idea of recursion so we'll try to understand the code uh, let's, uh, just take an overview of it so if uh, the character at index x of string 1 matches with the character index y of string 2 uh, this particular condition no edit is required and uh, and the edit distance uh, is and nothing is added to the edit distance so if the two string uh, if characters at index x and index y matches out so we won't be uh, adding up anything to the edit distance and we would be performing this recursion operation like we would be moving to the next token without adding up anything if they don't match this means that some edit is required uh, i think it's pretty obvious so these are the three operations that we would be performing one is for insertion in string 2 one is deletion in string 2 and other is replacement in string 2 using this recursive functions as you can see in the first one we are moving a one token ahead in uh, second string in the second one we are moving one token ahead in first string and in third condition we are moving uh, one token ahead in both the strings if any of the strings runs out of characters while recursion so uh, there would be a point where we would be reaching the end of the strings the length of the remaining characters of the other string so assume that one uh, one of the string has seven characters other has nine characters so the first string will end up uh, quickly as compared to quicker as compared to the second string so when the first string would be ending up we would be seeing ki what length of second string is remaining and all those get added to the edit distance because now everything has to be inserted right so this is the whole logic this is the point where we are insert where we are having that logic for once the length of a particular string gets exhausted the remaining length of the other string till which we have iterated will be considered